It is a, it's chaos, man. It's a lot of fun, a lot of energy at practices. Everybody's focused and, and dialed in at, on their job at hand. And um, I'm not even going to lie, things got a little chippy. I'm not going to say between who, but uh, the offense and defensive lines are, are, are trying to get their work in. They're trying to make sure everybody's ready for the game. And I mean, it just got me fired up yesterday, seeing, seeing everybody locked in and wanting to get their work in, you know, making sure that everybody's ready for the, the, for the task at hand on Sunday. And, um, I just love the focus and the energy of the team right now. It's natural for anyone to get high strung before big events. While the Kansas City Chiefs have become perennial Super Bowl participants at this point, they're still susceptible to nervousness. There are multiple ways people deal with nervousness, and most of them are valid. However, it's unavoidable for conflicts to arise when you have a bunch of uber-competitive athletes trying to be as prepared as they can for a sporting event as big as the Super Bowl. As the Kansas City Chiefs continued their Super Bowl 58 preparations, tensions reportedly got high among the players, which probably resulted in a very physical training session. Travis Kelsey says Chiefs practice got chippy on Wednesday between the offensive and defensive line as both units were trying to get their respective work in. It's understandable why both the O and D lines would be high-strung when facing the San Francisco 49ers. The Niners were extremely effective in bringing quarterbacks down this season notching 48 sacks despite only blitzing for 18% of all of their defensive snaps. San Francisco's offense is also terrific. They have a terrific QB who can improvise out of the pocket. They finish the regular season with the fourth most passing yards and the second most TDs. It also doesn't help that the team is in disarray with multiple personalities trying to get their way. The various distractions they faced all season could also affect their performance. However, Andy Reid trusts Patrick Mahomes and the rest of the Kansas City Chiefs to pull through when it mattered. They've been through worse situations than this, and they believe they have what it takes to pull off an incredible upset against a great football team.